गुड इवनिंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू श्री राम साई एस ऑन द अन अकेडमी प्लेटफॉर्म माई सेल्फ ए शैलेन्द्र प्रताप सिंह फैकल्टी एट श्री राम साई एस कवरिंग द टॉपिक्स ऑफ गवर्नेंस सोशल जस्टिस राइट रिलेटेड टू जी एस मेन्स पेपर सिविल ऑफ द यू पी एस सी सिविल सर्विसेस सो टूडे इट्स अ डेमो क्लास एंड आई शैल बी लुकिंग एट वन ऑफ द इम्पॉर्टेंट इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स ऑफ इंश्योरिंग अकाउंटेबिलिटी टू द गवर्नमेंट फ्रॉम द गवर्नमेंट राइट सो अकाउंटेबिलिटी आई हैड ऑलरेडी इन माई प्रीवियस क्लासेस आई हैव एक्सप्लेन वट इज अकाउंटेबिलिटी it is nothing but giving accounts ability to give accounts of one's own action right so accountability is why do you seek the accountability and from whom you because you are you are the citizens right and the the supply side whom uh, to, uh, you know the supply side is who it is the government right government uh, uh, government agencies right government officials so you seek the accountability in a democracy setup you give them the power right through the elections through various uh, and uh, and you give them the money through the taxes and they are to be held accountable for their actions that they make on uh, uh, our behalf to you know provide services to uh, you know citizens and uh, to take the decisions to manage the resources of this country efficiently and effectively because they are uh, because they are uh empowered to take the decisions on our behalf so we as a citizen try to seek accountability from them right for their actions in actions and their decisions that they take through in their course of action right so we seek accountability and we have seen there are many uh you know internal agencies which are there to you know uh accountability is you seek accountability from internal agencies internal setups like through the parliament right legislature takes accountability judiciary takes accountability there are various uh, oversight uh, you know the uh, oversight agencies right independent agencies constitutionally mandated to seek accountability from the executive from the government right so uh, there are agencies like cag right cic cbi courts right so these are oversight mechanism then you have legislature judiciary taking accountability in the legislature and parliament you have various mechanism through the question hour through the parliamentary committees through the budget demand of grants and all those things you seek accountability right but there are also external accountable mechanism and in that external accountable mechanism wherein citizen directly seek wherein citizen directly seek accountability from the government agencies for what uh, for what at all you know they do right in implementation of the government schemes in the performance of certain schemes so through other mechanisms like citizen charter rti uh, social audit right and media also right so media is also one of the important pillars of uh, you know democracy which seeks accountability from the government okay so we'll see the role of media in the democracy today okay so ye background dene ka matlab ye tha you are able to connect why i'm going to teach you the uh, role of media the, the role of media in is to ensure accountability to ensure that the government becomes more transparent to raise the voices for the people right in the democracy uh, you know uh, and to raise the issues you know raise the issues pertinent to the people right uh, pertinent to the nation's welfare right pertinent to managing the resources of the nations so what is the uh, role of media in seeking the accountability from the government and how is media uh, basically behaving in our country how what are the challenges associated with the media and what are their roles we'll see uh, in the classes okay so it is often called the fourth pillar okay it is often called the fourth pillar of the uh, what are the other three pillars we have the executive we have the legislature we have the judiciary right these are called three pillars of the state 
of a country okay and media uh, the role the media is defined the media is the the word comes from the medium right medium is a channel right the channel basically it seeks it is the role of the media is to present the news as it is right to highlight the problem or you know which needs the urgent uh, importance right so the role of media is a messenger role right sometimes media and in our country most of the time media sets the agenda basically kisi bhi topic pe ya kisi bhi agar white scale corruption hai if media highlights it it sets the agenda for the day even, even that topic even that agenda which is highlighted by the media can be even debated in the parliament right and executive can be asked the questions regarding those even the media asks questions directly to the officials directly to the ministers if at all any scams have taken place if at all there are question being raised upon some policies or the decisions right if at all there are some major accidents right media for example abhi kal ka example dekho there has been the rail uh, you know accident you know more than the official figure till now was 280 but i think more than 350 or 300 people have died right so railway is totally under the government of india right so how did the three rails collide together right you need to be held accountable for your decision why you uh, the minister is uh, here and there saying that we have introduced kavach system for you know uh, anti colliding system right made in india so why was that kavach system not implemented and not you know uh, put on the mission mode right why did not you prioritize that coverage system because in the past also there have been various instances of train accidents so the media is to highlight all those system where was the coverage system right so uh, uh, you know people's role uh, you know on the behalf of uh, people they ask question to the authorities right to they seek accountability from the authorities so media ka isliye role hum pad rahe hain theek hai इससे पहले परामा पेपर्स में परामा पेपर्स में सॉरी इट इट इज परामा पेपर्स सो इन दैट वेरियस इन्फ्लुएंशियल एलिट पीपल्स नेम वेयर हाइलाइटेड यू नो इन सेटिंग अप यू नो शेल कंपनीज अब्रॉड राइट सो उनके रोल्स तो अगेन इट वाज डन थ्रू वेरियस इंडिपेंडेंट इंस्टीट्यूशन एंड द मीडिया यू नो पब्लिश इट इन इट्स न्यूज then there was hindenburg report on the adani right so aise bahut sare hain jo media you know uh, publish karti hai though there are some problems also even the india against corruption movement it was it got a wide uh, led by the anna hazare and arvind kejriwal it got wide uh, publicity in face of what uh, you know media also supported this uh, you know anti corruption movement because there were wide scale perception and also the instances of corruption related to kolji and uh, you know 2g so all those things was highlighted and the media played somewhere the positive role in the nirbhaya uh, you know in the nirbhaya uh, this gang rape case also media uh, somewhere helped to mobilize the people to raise the awareness that our women need more security more protection from the laws right more uh, more uh, public safety measures right so media ka kaam time to time aap ऐसे आप सेट कर सकते हो एजेंडा सेटर का भी काम करती है मीडिया ओके देन वी हैव थ्री डीज राइट तो मीडिया हेल्प इन थ्री डीज में क्या होता है डिबेट डिस्कशन डिबेट डायलॉग डिस्कशन आप कहते हो ठीक है डिबेट डायलॉग एंड डेमोक्रेसी भी कह सकते हो इट गिव्स वॉइसेस टू द पीपल जिन जो लोग वॉइस भी द पीपल हु कैन नॉट रेज द वॉइसेस right how can they raise the voices and the government is audible right uh, uh, and the government can listen to your voices so it is through the media that the 10 people 20, 20 people can raise the voices if at all there are any uh, you know excessive uh, excesses of power that is being misutilized or against those citizens so media can highlight those things and the uh, administration and the government have to answer to those questions right so media is a democracy intensifying 
it has a democracy intensifying role right so it raises uh, voices on behalf of people so debate it uh, it also creates a culture of debate discussion and all those things right it key, uh, it also ensures informed economy right so media ka role it has been since the almost in our uh, 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 freedom uh, in our freedom struggle also the role of media has been quite quite phenomenal you know in raising this issues uh, related to in, uh, our freedom right so media ka role hamesha time to time hamesha important raha hamare chahe country ke uh, historically aap dekho modern india mein and then also today right so media contributes to good governance how it contributes to good governance rule of law right rule of law it ensures that anybody if at all on the on the toll taxes if some some of the officials and their family kins are not paying the taxes on the toll tax even the media even anybody today can you know videograph it you know publish it and even the media persons are there they can also capture it and write it down right so somewhere it provides a level playing field to all right it ensures that law is being abided by all the citizens it ensures that there are equal opportunities for the people right it ensures transparency through publishing the report accountability seeks media seeks accountability from the government and ensures openness also okay it uh, ensures participation of people free and fair elections building public trust okay public opinion right aap dekho agar if you see the role of media what it should be today the media is the uh, actually we'll see it in the challenges uh, today the role of media is quite different uh, you know it is bagging for the trp it is more aggressive journalism right uh, led by some few people so the role of media it shouldn't be like that you know uh, we have the center right and left uh, you know they are propagating their views so it is today the more of the role of the media has become more of the view shaper you know you know giving their own views right so the the role of media should not be looked at like that the important role should be to present the information as it is to the people right kya government ne kiya what the government has done what uh, you know it is thinking of doing and what all those things just present the facts to the people right and in the editorial section you uh, you know maybe uh, you present your views and through the debate discussion you, uh, you know different panel rather than shouting on the uh, you know national tv you can just uh, listen to all other parties right and have the proper confluence of the debate right there should be some you know outcome of the debate right uh, there should be some opinion building you know when you listen rather than just you know uh, the tv anchors who should be a neutral body uh, a neutral man or women uh, they uh, rather than they indulging and taking the sides it should be the neutral one right involving other people if at all the debates uh, channels on the tv are taking place so and and for the newspaper the traditional newspaper it should be presenting the information as it is and in the editorial section you give the opinion uh, you give the people the chance to uh, you know uh, have their freedom of expression right there you can read it so but nowadays it is more about corporate uh, you know journalism right people are backing certain sections and certain mindsets certain you know uh, stories to be published that is one of the uh, you know uh, challenging uh, you know aspect of the media right you you give the stories what you know the, you want the people to listen right so somewhere those nexus of corporate medias and even sub politicians so it is threatening the fourth Uh, pillars of the democracy right so it is uh, and we were seeing the role of media then it is also a watchdog media act as a watchdog government kya karti hai kya nahi karti kahan pe uh, fake encounters ho rahe hain ka nahi ho rahe hain everything is highlighted by the media and media seeks the accountability then you know it acts as a watchdog right even the government fears from the media they have this fear because they are government is there to exercise the control over the public over the resources of the uh, you know nation and the role of the media is to highlight on the behalf of the citizens you know on the behalf of the nation that why you are doing this and you are not to do this if at all this is mentioned in the rules and regulation right so all these things will come to the next point
वट आर द इशूज एंड रिलेटेड टू मीडिया देखो मीडिया से रिलेटेड आपको ऐसे भी आ सकता है आपको जी एस टू में क्वेश्चन भी आ सकते हैं राइट सो एटलीस्ट यू शुड हैव सम यू नो पॉइंट अबाउट मीडिया राइट एंड हाउ डज द मीडिया सीक्स अकाउंटेबिलिटी एंड वट इज द रोल ऑफ सोशल मीडिया एंड ऑल दो थिंग सो आई एज आई हाईलाइटेड मीडिया ओनरशिप इज वन ऑफ द इम्पॉर्टेंट चैलेंजेस हु ओन्स द मीडिया हु ओन्स दिस चैनल हु ओन्स सी एन एन हु ओन्स नो बडी नोज एंड वट काइंड ऑफ न्यूज एंड वट काइंड ऑफ ओरिएंटेशन दे यू नो बेसिकली दे प्रोपोगेट यू नीड टू नो राइट सो ये सारी चीजें इंपॉर्टेंट है एंड मीडिया प्रोजेक्शन एंड बाइसिस अब एक उनका पर्सनल ओपिनियन क्या है उस कॉर्पोरेट लॉबी दैट इज पुटिंग फंड्स इन दैट मीडिया चैनल वट इज द इंटरेस्ट ऑफ दो लॉबी यू नो फॉर वॉट प्रोजेक्ट एंड फॉर वॉट नॉट टूवर्ड्स विच पोलिटिकल आइडियोलॉजी और वॉट नॉट सो मीडिया प्रोजेक्शन एंड बाइसिस रादर देन मीडिया बींग न्यूट्रल वन neutral institution we have what we see today is media's you know massive projections and biases prejudices to a certain sections right uh, you know supporting certain uh, people who have certain ideologies right and uh, there is basically no real ground work also detachment from the ground realities so don't raise issues at the ground uh, you know at the ground and the block level or, or at the district level right we, uh, the, uh, we have certain uh, one or two or three uh, uh, local newspaper right in hindi in the local uh, uh, basically in different state you have different dialects and different languages so you have local newspaper at the ground level but there are hardly Few, a few, you know, national newspaper in the covering the, uh, uh, you know, uh, the different languages. Uh, they hardly raise questions about the groundwork. If, as a media, you are also a fourth pillar of state, you check the raw excesses of the government. So, if the government is fulfilling the idea, if the government says that we have covered ninety nine percent of the Swachh Bharat, so have you audited by as a as an independent agency, as a self regulating agency? have you checked the claims of the government have you uh, independently measures or acted as a was dog to uh, measure the performances of the schemes of the government and raise those issues in the you know through the media that is the exactly the role of and the constructive role of the media in the democracy right apart from the raising the criticism and inactions of the government you also need to appreciate and evaluate and recheck the performances of the policies uh, schemes programs from the government right and that is what our honorable prime minister also raises time and again the important is you also through an independent agencies you also check the role of the government right of the schemes and policies and most of the media is located in the metro cities uh, you know delhi mumbai and all those things so basically they have the workers that are that are more focused on the sensational issues rather than raising some of the ground realities questions also right about the nation so more focus is on sensationalism and trps right there are instances of paid news also kaun si paid news kya hota hai jo jo news uh, that propagates the news the piece of news that propagates certain ideologies or certain mindset of an a person who has paid for that news right it is not the finding of the media independent finding of the media rather than it is published on the behalf of the person who has paid for that news to the media right so it propagate it propagate certain type of news that the person wants to propagate and it is a uh, in india we uh, don't have the uh, you know this section right you can advertise but paid news is what is difference between advertisement and the paid news uh, basically paid news is something hidden advertisement right you are not known and you read it as a normal news but you are paid for that news right uh, the media, you uh, you have paid the media for that news right and advertisement is something that you know that uh, you know it is an advertisement and it has been uh, promoted by this company and that com- uh, company or by that person but paid news it's a hidden type of advertisement news okay so media is also self regulatory and one of those uh, you know uh, one of those criticism and the issues is that media try, tries to and 
in the democratic setup, in the modern democratic tradition, we have seen that media is, in general, media is seen as a uh, independent agencies, uh, right? So, uh, government cannot regulate media, right? It is against the notion, right? Uh, you cannot, uh, you cannot check the role. You uh, you cannot suppress because they uh, the the media as an institution they combinedly raise the issue that the uh, so government is trying to suppress it, right? Freedom of expression is being threatened. So media has to be, in general, the self-regulatory in that they are not able to self-regulate themselves. And that is why you have so many issues that we face through the uh, media. One of the important issues also, the way forward that, you know, uh, we see that the, uh, our media, uh, our Indian media has not, Inter, uh, internationalize itself, right? So, we need more of the internationalization of our media, right? Spreading the word of the mouth, uh, you know, creating some, uh, you know, taking the news from the world and, you know, creating some uh, news channels or the media which are world famous, like you have New York Times, Washington Post, Reuters, right? Al Jaljeera, uh, all these channels, but you will listen to none of the India's channel who have the world coverage, who who are, uh, you know, uh, popular on the lines of all these news channels. So, one of the important issues that our uh, government and the Prime Minister uh, from the time to time have raised this issue that you, the, the Indian media needs the global presence. We also need to highlight the issues face and that is how you propagate your, that is how you propagate your Indian culture also and it is one of the instrument of the uh, spreading uh, uh, the soft power, okay. Okay, so we will see the next slide. So, what are the issues we had seen? Uh, media, ke baare mein thoda humne padha. Abhi social media ek uska part hai, media ka. Media ek larger term hai, social media abhi recent phenomena hai. Right, what is the social media? So, so, so social media kya hai? Koi bhi application hai, website hai, application hai that enables user to basically create content, right, share content, exchange information, participate in social networking. So, OEB bhi aisa, uh, you know, media, social media kya hai, internet based application platform hai, through the website or through some platforms, right, jahaan pe aap apna content create kar sakte ho. Abhi kya hai, media mein, some media persons will only be able to uh, create the content, but Social media gives the power to every individual who has just an internet connection and who is present on certain platforms. They can also create their own opinion and they can also, you know, participate. They can exchange their views. They can participate. They can create a community within the social media, right? Uh, they can exchange certain kind of, uh, you know, uh, culture, certain type of content, right? So, it's a uh, form of social networking, right? So, it's called social media. Bhi hai. Platforms, kya kya hai? Sare social media, Instagram, Twitter, are some of the examples of the social media, okay? So, social media ko dekha, ab uske uh, merits dekhte hai. Social media ne kya kya cheeze ki hai, thik hai? Okay. So, social media ka merits dekhte hai, thik hai? Breaking the monopoly of big media houses, pehla to... देखो अभी क्या था आ, कि हमारे जो मीडिया है ना इनका क्या हो रहा था ये कॉर्पोरेट कॉर्पोरेटाइजेशन हो रहा था बड़े-बड़े रिलायंस एंड ऑल दोस डिफरेंट डिफरेंट कॉर्पोरेट्स वर ओनिंग सर्टेन मीडिया हाउसेस राइट सो जब ये काफी बड़े-बड़े कॉर्पोरेट्स के द्वारा जब मीडिया का जो प्राइवेटाइजेशन एंड कॉर्पोरेटाइजेशन हो रहा है सो उस केस में सोशल मीडिया यू नो इट ब्रेक्स द मोनोपोली ऑफ द बिग media houses abhi aap dekhoge on the on the channels also on the social media platforms you have different subscriber you know independent subscriber so it has somewhere created it has democratized if in a proper word you can use it it has democratized the media it has democratized the structure of the media right usko अभी कोई भी इंसान एक यू नो इंडिपेंडेंट चैनल के साथ दे कैन क्रिएट देयर ओन न्यूज़ दे कैन यू नो प्रोपोगेट द यू नो न्यूज़ दैट इज जस्ट फेयर राइट मे बी एंड देयर आर डिफरेंट यू नो सेक्शंस एंड द इंडिपेंडेंट मीडिया हाउसेस ऑन द चैनल्स एंड द सोशल मीडिया आल्सो दैट दैट आर प्रोपोगेटिंग देयर न्यूज़ आल्सो सो बट व्हाट वी आर थ्रू इट 
what we are seeing that it has broken it has uh, you know it, it has uh, been breaking the monopoly of the big media houses right so abhi ek citizen bhi twitter pe ja kar ke it can create their it can you know write their own opinion it can create their own opinion right uh, people can share their own opinion even you know you can complain you can you know raise your voices through the twitter and on the railway ministry or even the police department of that district has to respond back right so somewhere social media also ensures that uh, you directly as a citizen you directly can seek accountability you directly can ask you know through the today everyone every department has a social media coverage right uh, social media presence also they have right so you can directly seek you can directly tag them right and seek responsibility from them okay from the government agencies okay so somewhere uh, you know it has empowered more people it has created a medium right social media platform is a medium again right where in you can directly interact with the citizens right rather than some media houses are you know raising the issues on your behalf you are directly you know involved and you can directly seek grievances from your uh, government agencies and whatever issues you want to raise you can raise it right so it has created the culture of informed citizenry right today the information whatever the government uh, you know uh, wants to do whatever it plans to do it can spread you know like anything viral on the social media right koi bhi information hai ya koi bhi even fake news are spreading like you know in a, in a few seconds or the hour so but on the positive side koi bhi information hai uh, it has created the culture of informed citizenry people today uh, the netizens and the informed citizens uh, the citizens are more informed about their rights right about their duties because they read you know whatever the government wants to do right so it has created the culture of informed jahan citizen apne rights duties and laws and regulations ke bare mein more informed hai right it is a more cheapest and the fastest uh, way of communication right kuch paise nahi lagte maybe a internet connection very cheap in india right so you can be a news maker you can create you can create your own channel it is a fastest and the cheapest way of pro- propagating your news to the government right to uh, you know uh, even exchanging your views with the government right creating your own information even creating your own subscribers right so it's a cheapest and the fastest way of communication internet mein ek click of mouse se kahan se kahan information chali jati hai kahan se kahan aati hai rather than ek pura traditional way hai media ka jahan paper chhapta hai jahan ek houses baithti hain jahan ek channels hote hain tab ja kar ke media nikalti hai so it's more easy way of i uh, you know communication right it's more easy of propagating the news that you want to spread it's a spread of social activist movement social media ka hum dekhenge bahut sare movements mein bhi bahut kaam aaya you know like india against corruption movement like nirbhaya right so bahut sare aise social movements bhi hain jisme social media ne bahut uh, vibrant role play kiya in a democracy right so it has raised awareness it has raised issue also even the me too movement me too movement right so ye bhi ek social media pe uh, jahan social media you know me too movement mein kya hua tha bahut sare agar iske aap issues dekho to it gave voices to many of the uh, females who had faced the harassment in their you know offices right in their uh, working culture right so jab bhi wo apne uh, life time mein whenever they face the harassment so they were not able to raise their voices right? in that cultural or socio cultural milieu where you did not have much of the arrangement to raise your voices and the society would not listen right but social media gave them a platform where they can even keep their uh, you know identity uh, hidden sometimes and also if at all you know somewhere it gave them the platform where you know they can directly uh, you know uh, tell their uh, stories tell their you know harassment stories whatever they had faced and seek their redressal right maybe you know after many years but yes it gave them the platform right so all these movement social mo- movement have their underlying effect on you know the role of social media in our setup right so it has pre- uh, you know uh, provided the culture it has thronged it has spreaded the culture of democracy uh, democracy discussion debate dialogues abhi dekhte hain bahut sare twitter pe bhi bahut sare counter narrative narrative 
यू नो डायलॉग्स डिबेट्स बहुत सारे ऐसे चलते रहते हैं सो समवेयर यू नो सोशल मीडिया इज हेल्पिंग इन ऑल दीज थिंग्स पार्टिसिपेटरी डेमोक्रेसी अगेन पार्टिसिपेटरी क्यों है भाई क्योंकि एवरीबडी टुडे इज हैविंग द से आप एक गांव में भी पीपल हैविंग द इंटरनेट कनेक्शन कैन रेज द वॉइसिस कैन क्रिएट सर्टन ओपिनियंस राइट उनके भी ओपिनियन या अगर वो ट्रैवलिंग कर रहे हैं या कहीं अगर इफ एट ऑल दे आर फेसिंग इन इशू इशू दे कैन रेज द वॉइसिस इवन द पीपल हु इवन द इंडियंस हु आर स्टक आउटसाइड सो दे कैन डायरेक्टली यू नो कॉन्टैक्ट द मिशन कॉन्टैक्ट द मिशन अब्रॉड इंडियन मिशन अब्रॉड एंड दे कैन सीक द हेल्प सो सम वे आर द सोशल मीडिया हैज इंटीग्रेटेड इट हैज मोर ग्लोबलाइज द वर्ल्ड इट हैज यू नो क्रिएटेड मोर स्ट्रॉन्ग कम्युनिटी ऑन द सोशल ऑन द इंटरनेट प्लेटफॉर्म्स राइट सो ऐसा तो मेरिट्स है ठीक है डी मेरिट्स भी देख लेते हैं फटाफट तो इश्यूज रिलेटेड टू सोशल मीडिया क्या है क्या क्या इश्यूज है कई कई सारे तो देखो डिस इन्फॉर्मेशन मिस इन्फॉर्मेशन ठीक है पहले गलत इन्फॉर्मेशन फेक न्यूज काफी फैलते हैं ठीक है वो चीज हम देखेंगे डिस इन्फॉर्मेशन मिस इन्फॉर्मेशन देखो मिस इन्फॉर्मेशन क्या होता है कि आपने गलत तरीके से मतलब आपने इन्फॉर्मेशन तो सही इंटेंशन के साथ दिया बट वो इन्फॉर्मेशन गलत है एंड इट इज गेटिंग वायरल सो गवर्नमेंट एजेंसी समटाइम्स कम साफ की ये जो इन्फॉर्मेशन है गलत है हम गलती से छप गया बट वी डिड नॉट इंटेंड टू सो कभी गलती से इन्फॉर्मेशन और स्प्रेड हो जाए सो दैट इज मिस इन्फॉर्मेशन और विद इन अ क्लिक इट कैन बी स्प्रेड विद इन वन आवर इट कैन बिकम अ वायरल राइट सो मिस मिस इन्फॉर्मेशन इज ऑल्सो वन ऑफ द टूल डिस इन्फॉर्मेशन इज समथिंग यू क्रिएट द फेक इन्फॉर्मेशन राइट इन्फॉर्मेशन आप जान बूझ करके विद द रॉन्ग इंटेंशन यू स्प्रेड दैट इन्फॉर्मेशन दैट इज इट डिस इन्फॉर्मेशन ऑल्सो राइट सो इसके अलावा क्या इश्यूज हैं रेडिकलाइजेशन ऑफ द यूथ लिंक्स टू आइसिस अगर आप केरला स्टोरी देखो उसमें ये चीजें नहीं दी है उसमें तो चलो दूसरी चीजें हैं लेकिन अगर आप देखोगे बहुत सारे न्यूज में द हिंदू एंड द इंडियन एक्सप्रेस हैड कवर्ड लॉट ऑफ द यंग पीपल ज्वाइनिंग द आइसिस एंड द आइसिस वॉज रिक्रूटिंग द यंग यू नो मे बी डिसफ्रेंचाइज यूथ मतलब जो अपने मेन स्ट्रीम से अलग हट चुके हैं ड्यू टू अनएम्प्लॉयमेंट ड्यू टू नॉट स्किलिंग इनफ राइट सो ड्यू टू बींग यू नो लिविंग द एजुकेशन इन बिटवीन ड्यू टू दर फैमिली इशू सो तो पीपल हु वे आर नॉट गेटिंग द बेनिफिट सम वे द रेडिकल आउट विंग ऑफ आइसिस वे आर ट्राइंग टू वू दिटीजन यंग सिटीजन थ्रू द सोशल मीडिया थ्रू द ग्लोबल प्रेजेंस दे वर रिक्रूटिंग दे वर ट्रेनिंग एंड दे वर कॉलिंग दैम टू फाइट for certain uh, ideologies right so uh, it has been found that social media has acted as a platform right to you know so basically jo platform hai wo kahin na kahin aap galat purpose ke liye it is uh, one of the security uh, threats to our nation maybe a global peace also right so ye ek one of the stances paaya gaya communal violence aap dekhe ho more harm to the diverse society india mein agar kisi bhi community ke khilaf आप कुछ भी ऐसे यू नो लिखते हो और व्हेन इट स्प्रेड्स लाइक अ वायरल थिंग राइट सो द कंट्री एज डाइवर्स एज इंडिया वेर यू हैव अ यू नो डिफरेंट कल्चर्स हर 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 दस किलोमीटर पे डिफरेंट कल्चर आते हैं और यू हैव मोर देन सिक्स हंड्रेड ऑफ डायलैक्ट्स इन द कंट्री यू हैव डिफरेंट रिलीजन रीजन राइट Uh, different uh, demographics. So, in this case, me, whenever you know, it's a more globalized phenomenon, so one bhi galat news, kisi bhi community ke khilaaf, kisi bhi chizo ke khilaaf, it can create more harms to the you know fragile uh, and uh, fragile uh, you know demographic and the countries and and uh, you know uh, regions of India, right? So, ye bhot uh, social media me uh, rather than being an integrating factor. as a globalized factor social media can also create some of the some of the uh, basically some of the breaking points of those society right fault lines it can create those fault lines also right fault line in the society theek hai everyone is news creator today so kiski news credible hai kiski news nahi credible hai ye bhi bada sawal hai kisi ne apna news chhapa hai किसी ने अपना न्यूज क्रिएट किया है बट किसकी न्यूज क्रेडिबल है ये भी आपको जानना बहुत जरूरी है राइट सो वी से दैट वी आर लिविंग इन अ पोस्ट ट्रूथ वर्ल्ड पोस्ट 
पोस्ट ट्रूथ वर्ल्ड का मतलब है कि क्रेडिबिलिटी ऑफ इंफॉर्मेशन यू नो वॉट आई एम स्पीकिंग इज द ट्रूथ राइट सो ट्रूथ हैज मेनी फेस एट टूडे देर इज नो वन मोर यू नो वन ट्रूथ राइट ट्रूथ आज बहुत सारी ट्रूथ है सबका अपना वर्जन है राइट सो लिविंग इन पोस्ट ट्रूथ वर्ल्ड सो ये कहीं ना कहीं ये भी बहुत प्रॉब्लमेटिक है यू नो सो मो ऑफ द इमेज हेरेसमेंट एंड ऑप्सिन यू नो थिंग्स यू सी मो ऑफ द इमेज ऑफ सम ऑफ द गर्ल्स दैट आर बींग स्प्रेड वायरली यू नो हेरेसमेंट कॉल्स यू हैड कम अक्रॉस वन ऑफ द सीरीज लाइक जब तारा यू सी थ्रू द सोशल मीडिया ऑल्सो थ्रू द you know uh, use of modern technologies you know people are being threatened right uh, so there are false opinion building addiction also is addiction to the social media like instagram facebook twitter jab aapko addiction ho jaye jab aapke apne you know cheezon se zyada agar social media aapko zyada acha lagne lage to you have the false addiction it is uh, playing with your what dopamine right uh, it is uh, making you मोर अटेंशन सीकर राइट आपका आपका माइंड भी कंसेंट्रेट होने में बड़ा प्रॉब्लमेटिक है राइट सो अडिक्शन इज कॉजिंग अस मोर ऑफ द साइकोलॉजिकल डैमेज राइट सो ये भी वन ऑफ द इशूज है सो सोसाइटी बिकमिंग मोर डिसरप्टिव अब देखो ये इस चीज का मतलब क्या है सोसाइटी बिकमिंग मोर डिसरप्टिव आप देखो मोर ऑफ द सोशल मीडिया से अभी तक क्या है एक कनेक्टिंग फैक्टर कनेक्टिंग लिंक है सारे सोसाइटीज में अभी कोई भी चीजों को आपको मोबालाइज करना है कोई भी इश्यूज के अगेंस्ट में जैसे इंडिया अगेंस्ट करप्शन ही देख लो इतना पॉपुलर क्यों हुआ क्योंकि तब तक सोशल मीडिया आ चुका था एंड टू मोबालाइज अगेंस्ट वन थिंग यू यू नो सोशल मीडिया इज वेरी गुड चैनल सो आज के टाइम में इंफॉर्मेशन ओवरलोड भी ज्यादा है यू हैव मच ऑफ द इन्फॉर्मेशन प्रेजेंट राइट इन्फॉर्मेशन एवरी वन इज गोइंग डिजिटल एवरी वन इज गोइंग डिजिटल एंड एवरी डिपार्टमेंट एवरी you know places are going digital so more information is coming online us information se social media platform aa raha hai wo information wo spread bhi ho raha hai kisi direction mein theek hai aur people are present so koi bhi agar issue if at all has to be raised so those information you know creates certain opinion building on all those things and those information can be manufactured according to one's own will ya koi issue agenda aata hai to wo लोग उतने इंफॉर्मेशन पा करके यू नो इट क्रिएट्स मैसिव डिसरप्शन वो किसी ओपिनियन बिल्डिंग में भी या सोशल मीडिया पे आउटरेज हो सकता है किसी ओपिनियन को लेकर के किसी भी चीजों को तो आज के टाइम में और उसका इम्प्लीकेशन क्या होता है उसका इम्प्लीकेशन सोसाइटी पे देखने को मिलती है तो जब भी आप देखोगे जब पुलिस वगैरह जब कहीं एक्टिव होती है या कहीं पे भी कुछ भी वॉयस वॉयलेंस होते हैं जैसे अभी मणिपुर में तो इंटरनेट गॉट डिसरप्टेड जम्मू कश्मीर में इंटरनेट को बंद कर दिया जाता है पहले पहले सो दैट इन्फॉर्मेशन ही नहीं फैल पाए मोर इन्फॉर्मेशन मीन पीपल आर स्प्रेडिंग पीपल आर फाइंडिंग वेज टू मोबालाइज सो सोशल मीडिया इज ऑल्सो क्रिएटिंग मोर डिसरप्शन इन द सोसाइटी राइट सो क्योंकि इट इज हेल्पिंग इन क्रिएटिंग मोर मोबालाइजेशन राइट तो नेक्स्ट देखते हैं वे फॉरवर्ड क्या है रेगुलेट एंड कोलेबरेट विद एजेंसी राइट कोलेबरेट विद सिटीजन राइट सो रेगुलेशन सेल्फ रेगुलेशन इज the key social media ka one of the important factors is collaborate also collaborate with the government agencies support them right kyunki bahut sare citizens ke bhi issues hain social media pe you know related to data privacy and all those so collaborate with the you know government also and you regulate also uh, social media is needed as it fills the void between the citizens and the administration right so citizen or administration ke beech mein ek platform hai to ye kahin na kahin directly contact karati hai so more fluidity access and outreach is there so proper coc code of conduct rules have to be framed for the government officials so as to ensure what so as to ensure that you have the proper uh, public servant uh, you know you have the public servant behaving properly in the social media rather than you know uh, chest thumping uh, you know and rather than uh, you know promoting themselves as a social media hero you see a lot of uh, you know uh, public servants having their own channel or created uh, have uh, created their own channel and spreading their uh, you know heroism that's okay uh, you uh, you got to do your work but uh, you know uh, the the intention the one of the true uh, hallmarks of the bureaucracy is anonymity you have to work under the 
wo uh, under the ca uh, carpet you have to work uh, behind the curtain right uh, so that is one of the important instrument also so proper code of conduct uh, if you are a government agent right if you are a public servant if you are working on the behalf of government you can you are also forbidden to criticize the programs and policies of the government right so all these things social media conduct rules like the uh, european union have created it so you need to have those all things also okay ethical issues for administrator to regulate their conduct ye important and training on the social media management so every government and departments and uh, ministries and even the agencies need to train themselves so there should be a proper training and uh, you know courses on the social media management so this is all a uh, very brief class uh, regarding uh, media and the social media what point format mein aap logo ko samjhaya so that kuch na kuch aap wahan reproduce karo jab bhi aap is class ko uh, padho ya is class ko aage discuss karo theek hai uh, ya exam mein uh, civil services ya kahin pe bhi in general also as a citizens if at all you uh, need be you should know uh the what are the issues and what are the roles of the media in our country and uh, issues uh and the uh, merits and demerits pertain uh, you know pertaining to social media okay thank you and have a nice day